Anatomy Cerebral Cortex The outermost layer of the forebrain is called the cerebral cortex, often referred to as the gray matter. It is responsible for many higher cognitive functions, including language, memory, decision-making, and conscious awareness. The cortex is highly convoluted and divided into two hemispheres, the left and right cerebral hemispheres. Subcortical Structures Beneath the cerebral cortex are several important subcortical structures, including the thalamus, hypothalamus, amygdala, and basal ganglia, which all play distinct roles in various functions. Cognition The forebrain is central to our cognitive processes, including thinking, reasoning, problem-solving, and planning. The cerebral cortex is responsible for these complex mental functions. Sensory processing Sensory information from the environment, e.g., vision, hearing, touch, is initially processed in the forebrain. Different areas of the cortex are specialized for different sensory modalities. Emotion and motivation The amygdala Part of the limbic system within the forebrain plays a key role in processing emotions and generating emotional responses. The hypothalamus is involved in regulating emotions and motivation. Memory The hippocampus, a structure within the forebrain, is crucial for the formation and retrieval of long-term memories. Motor control the basal ganglia is involved in motor control and coordination. It helps initiate and regulate voluntary movements. Homeostasis The hypothalamus is responsible for maintaining homeostasis in the body, regulating functions such as body temperature, hunger, thirst, and sleep. Hemispheric specialization the cerebral hemispheres, left and right, have distinct functions, with some degree of lateralization. In most right-handed individuals, the left hemisphere is associated with language processing, while the right hemisphere is often more involved in spatial reasoning and certain aspects of creativity. Connections the forebrain is extensively interconnected with other brain regions and receives input from various sensory and motor pathways. The corpus callosum is a large bundle of nerve fibers that connects the two hemispheres, allowing them to communicate and share information. Development During embryonic development, the forebrain is one of the first regions to form and is derived from the neural tube. It undergoes complex processes to differentiate into its various structures. Clinical Implications Many neurological and psychiatric conditions are associated with the forebrain, including Alzheimer's disease, which affects memory, schizophrenia, which involves disturbances in perception and thought, and epilepsy, which can originate in the cerebral cortex. In summary, the forebrain is a complex and crucial region of the brain responsible for a wide range of functions, from high-level cognition to emotional regulation and sensory processing. It is a central hub for our conscious experience and is integral to our overall functioning as humans.